The unable to connect to Samsung server error message is basically seen while watching the online content on the Samsung Smart TV. The error appears with a short message unable to connect to the Samsung server. Check your network settings or try again later, 100, accompanied with a solution that is not effective in solving the problem. Let's start with the different ways that you can implement for rectifying the mentioned problem. Method 1. Power cycle your device. Before starting with the next listed complex methods here it is suggested to unplug your Samsung Smart TV and router completely from the sockets. Then after unplugging on both the devices hit the power buttons for approximately 10 seconds to drain the static electricity wait for at least 2 minutes before switching it on. Method 2. Reset Smart Hub. Once your Samsung television has started up, press the setting button on your remote. Using the arrow keys, highlight the support option in the left pane, and press OK to enter it. Navigate to self-diagnosis and then highlight the reset smart hub option. Enter your PIN and press OK to reset smart hub. Note, default PIN is 0000. Wait until the resetting process is completed and proceed with the setup of the TV. After setting everything up, check to see if the issue is still persist. Method 3. Update Samsung TV Firmware. Start up your TV and press the setting button on your remote. Use the arrow keys to highlight the support option at the left side and press OK to enter it. Click on the update software option to update your software to the latest version. Method 4. Signing out of Samsung account. Navigate to Settings, General, System Manager, Samsung Account, select My Account and then hover over your account's icon. Press the Select button on your remote and then select the Sign Out button from the window that pops up. Now, reset the Smart Hub after your account signs out using the second method. Sign in to your Samsung account on your computer and confirm any new terms and conditions or prompts. After the smart hub has been reset on your TV, sign back into your account and check if the issue is prevalent. Method 5. Using VPN. If you are suffering from a regional issue, you will have to use a VPN connection to connect your TV to the country where you purchased the television from. This VPN can be applied to the router by default and then you can use a wired connection to use on the television but you will have to check in with your router and VPN provider for more details on how to achieve this configuration. Method 6. Change DNS server on Samsung TV. Press the menu button on your TV remote and then select network. Select the network status option and then select IP settings. Set the IP setting to obtain automatically but change the DNS setting to enter manually. Enter 8.8.8.8 as the DNS server. Save your settings and check to see if the issue is still prevalent. Method 7. Reset network settings. Navigate to settings. General. Network. Click on the reset network button and confirm any prompts that are presented on the next screen. Wait for the network to be reset and check to see if the unable to connect to the Samsung server issue still exists. Method 8. Factory Reset. If nothing has worked for you to solve the problem then reset your Samsung TV to its factory default settings or and see if the unable to connect to Samsung server error in Samsung TV is resolved or not. Warning, this will reset everything back to system defaults so be careful before applying this solution to your television.